1989. It has Swiss design and engineering, so they always bring us great quality items, functional items, innovative items. This one is no exception because it is so easy to do. I have this at home. I use it all the time. Do you know how much my husband appreciates that? Because I don't have to hand it to him and say, here, honey, can you open this for me? <laughs> and then I always say, I loosened it up for you. And then he opens it. Well, no more of that. This is one of those items that allows you to take something like this that has the adjustability on the, you know what, I'm gonna use a different color. It'll be easier to see if I show it on the red. You see these black pieces right there. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and spread those apart and I can open anything that basically would fit between these three and bringing it together and those three. So something small, something big, everything. And we have several colors of these to go around. We're going to show them. I, in front of me, I have black, aqua, and red, but we have a whole lot of colors on qvc.com. So we'll go through them with you. So we have the gray for you. We have eggplant, tangerine, white. Here's the slate blue and the sage. Actually, can we go back to the slate? Cause I have a feeling that was aqua but maybe um, we call that one slate. Can we see the aqua then right after it? Okay, they're, yeah, they're, but they're very, very similar. Okay, gotcha. Anyway, yeah, slate has a little more gray to it. Okay, there we go. Um, Mark Charles Massilli is joining me. He is our kitchen gadget guru, and um, it's so good to see you. And you can point out better what's the difference between the slate and the aqua, but uh, yeah, how are actually, you, sir? I, good. I have them right here if you want to see them up close so yes. they can see the aqua and the slate. Thank you. You've got that farmhouse is really the slate. You see that? That's the aqua yeah. and that's the farmhouse. That's see the difference a lot there? better. Thank you so right? much. No yes. worries. No worries. I got all the colors here if you ever want to go through them again. Okay. So how are you, Mary Beth? And I'm you know this, great. you and I have been selling a version of this for what, 22 years now? Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. know why? Because we haven't needed to change the actual concept because Swiss Engineering did it right. What we do is change the color and all the extra features. So let's go through it. You showed, Mary Beth showed perfectly, three stainless steel locking teeth that are important because what happens is, see this little, that's what's changing the circumference. That's very easy, no strength needed. Wherever you stop, it actually locks into place. That gives you the leverage. So let me put it to work. You open up wide, I always say, you go over the jar and then squeeze. I'm gonna just turn this upside down so you see what's happening. You have three points of contact. One, two, and I'm gonna flip this over, and three. So all you do, is take your hand, fingertips, right? And fingertips, it breaks that factory seal every time. You literally need no strength in your wrist or your hand because this engineering has created the suction. I'm gonna do it again for you to show you. This is my favorite demo. Look at the size, look at the size <laughs> of this very best. Did you get bigger pickles? No, so I when don't you're think fearful, so. <laughs> if you're fearful of that, watch this guys, look at that. That easily wow. just opened that factory pickle yeah that was the largest jar we could find Isn't and by the way these are not jars that have been open prior to us doing this no okay? way jose we don't we don't <laughs> trick you like that sorry guys <laughs> you know that's just it but how many times do you want to open a spaghetti jar right and now i'm going to just tighten that down like that and then bang now I'm serious, I couldn't hardly do that. I should have tried that first, you know, tried the, the old fashioned way. And then all you have to do is just open that up like this, and then there's your lid. Um, it's that simple. It, it's almost so simple that you, it's, it's almost hard to believe. Like it's yeah. like when I, now that when I do it, I think, should I have tried that first? You know, maybe it was that easy, but it's not, you know? So here's another jar, can I open it? I'm trying, I really am. I can't open that pickle, that jar, whatever is this thing. Ooh, those are jalapeno peppers, okay. I don't want that to go. I'm gonna lock that down and then let me just give that a little, okay, hang on, let me lock that down. There we go. Okay, 
Righty tighty lefty I, loosey. Make sure you in the right direction. I, yeah, there we, there go. we go. I just, it took a little more strength, but that's okay. But that's how close that was. Yes. You see how close that was? I you, know. There was no way you were ever going to get that open with your bare hands. That's the problem. Not at all. So, what I love too, Mary Beth, is it's four of the features on the other side that to this jar opener. We call it the five yeah. and one. So everything's going to be on this side, and I'll show you what's on this side. We gave you what's called a little parrot parrot beak because yeah. there are cans out there that have the pull tabs, yeah. right? I go underneath, I roll. Now this is a very sharp edge that I can't avoid right in the can, but look where my hands are, yeah. completely away from that. So that's really great to have the parrot beak. Then we give you this stainless steel, some people call it a church key, a skeleton key, yeah. but they have to be stainless steel to open up uh, alcoholic or non-alcoholic because you don't want it to rust or pit on you. Then we give you this little guy because this only goes so small. So there are little spice bottles like this, like the Tabasco, yeah. also great on nail polish when you're opening up nail polish a second time. And yeah. I'm twisting the bottle, if you notice. Let this do the work. And more importantly, if you look real close, I didn't even have to take the wrapper oh. off. It actually takes that wow. and the wrapper, and you're gonna go boop and pop that out. That's and last amazing. but not least, the fifth function is right here. Yeah. There's a graduated cap on there. So when you mm -hmm. twist the bottle again, let the, and it breaks that seal right there. And now all bottles from personal water bottles up to three liter bottles have the same size cap, a little trivia there, and they all fit inside of there to open up and break that seal. Wow. And I got to tell you, sometimes those caps are the toughest ones. You know, Always. they really can it's be. It's leverage. Um, it's now, getting the leverage. Let me just get this one over here. What is this? Kalamata olives. Okay, here we go. Let's give this a try. I'm going to lock that down like that. Oh, my goodness. Okay, come on blink? now. Did that you was blink? Just, see, I'm telling you, it Sometimes makes... Sometimes it's too easy. I know. You're like, what in the world? I could have done that. No, you saw me. I tried on that one. And some of those jars are just so difficult. Um, okay, so literally, this one, I have to tell you, we've sold 250,000 of these. 250,000. That's more than a quarter of a million of these. We have had over 325 five-star reviews. I want you to show me the colors again, Mark Charles, because okay. you have them right in front of you, yep. and I think it's easier to see them. Okay, so we're going to start with the black that's all the way on this side. There's that black. You can see it all there. Beautiful. Then, of course, the red. There's that aqua that Mary Beth was talking about. My favorite tangerine, that's the one that I brought to the, to the collection. Uh, the white, of course. That's your gray, really beautiful mated. That's the eggplant. And we're calling this um, sage, right? Yes, I believe and so. Then yes. That's the slate. Remember the slate, just to give you a reference, there's the aqua, there's the slate, guys. So you got a more earthy. These two were brought in because it's the farmhouse collection. Like people love farmhouse colors. This yeah. is more like bright, think of seashore. Um, uh -huh. you know, beachy kind of colors kind yeah. of thing. So you've got I the brighter that. colors and then the more muted colors. A great collection. And, yeah. and Mary Beth, we should tell them, if you have my can opener, these colors match to them. They so do. So if you want sister product to the can opener, you can get the matching one that goes with it. I have the aqua, because I my kitchen's all done now in aqua. And I just put this on this little water bottle. Yep. All right? And I can just, look at that. Whoop! It tipped over the jar while I was going around. Look at that. That, that opened great? right up. We actually, it, it's amazing because sometimes bottles are some of the hardest things to open. Water bottles, iced tea bottles, you name it. And so this one works. It's just a great piece. And like you say, it gives you leverage. I have arthritis in my hands. It's not easy for me to open things anymore, which I hate to admit, but it's true. Yeah, and again, Mary Beth, it might not even be an arthritis situation. It could yeah. be, you just can't get the grip. Your hand doesn't fit around the jar, maybe. Right. Like, so it could be like a strength thing, an age thing, an arthritis thing. But yeah. every day, I don't care what age you are, we need help opening these factory sealed foods. Yeah. And that's, that's right. what they came up with, this technology, is what, you know the secret behind all of this, right? Is that they're breaking the vacuum. It's not that the jar is too much to open up right. or that... You know, the, the lid's too big or it's too thick of a stainless. It's because they pressure vacuum seal it. So that becomes almost like a glue. Yeah. And that's the whole difference between this is it breaking that seal. The minute air gets in there, the vacuum's gone. It's like, boop, and you can open it. Yeah. And the other two problems we have that we should mention too, Mary Beth, with this Go is back. medications and things that yes. are wrapped. You right, see this barbecue exactly. sauce? Yeah. Completely wrapped. I want to point out something. You do not have to take a knife or anything and unwrap that with my fingertips. Look at this. I'm pulling this off and it wow. took the wrapper with it. Two in one. 
Okay. Then the other thing is this. Yeah. Show the, me the, the, the bottles. Medication. Yes. Because that's important whether it's Pepto or medications or vitamins. Look at this. That easy now you can open up your medication again. Is that even the sense. ones that you have to normally push down and twist? Yes. Yeah, they call it they call it child safety. That's the point. Yeah. It works. It says it right down the cap. Child safety. <laughs> I've never I call it adult safety. Uh, exactly. I, I was going to say, I've never used this for that, but I'm going to do that now. You, you might want to get more than one. Keep one in the bathroom. Keep one in the kitchen. I love it. A good idea. This good is idea. a I love great it. product. It's truly the solution to a big, big problem for $22.98. Mark Charles, thank you so much. Thanks, my friend. In the meantime, we've got more easy things to use that are making your life better. 